हेलो फ्रेंड्स दिस इज डॉक्टर खुशबू वाघेला एसोसिएट प्रोफेसर एट द शारदा स्कूल ऑफ फार्मेसी पीथापुर गांधीनगर टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू अ वेरी ब्रीफ इंट्रोडक्शन अबाउट द हर्बल कॉस्मेस्यूटिकल्स वॉट इज कॉस्मेटिक सो वी ऑल नो दैट कॉस्मेटिक्स आर द सब्सटेंस विच इज मेनली यूज टू इन्हांस द ऑर्डर एंड द अपियरेंस ऑफ द ह्यूमन बॉडी एंड वेन एवर इट इज एन हर्बल कॉस्मेटिक्स इट मीन्स दैट द ड्रग्स विच इज प्रिपेयर फ्रॉम द प्लांट्स और प्लांट्स प्रोडक्ट्स वट इज द नीड ऑफ कॉस्मेटिक्स सो मेनली वेन द वुमन इज वेरिंग अ मेकअप इट मीन्स दैट दैट वुमन मे फील बेटर अबाउट हर सेल्फ एंड हैविंग टू हैंस द बिलीव इन हर सेल्फ एंड एनहांस द सेल्फ कॉन्फिडेंस the word cosmeceuticals it means that these are the cosmetics which are having some of the biologically active ingredients or they are having the drug like effect or medicinal property the word herbal is attached with the cosmeceuticals it means that the cosmetic which is prepared from the herbal plants and which are having the herbal uh, which are having the medicinal property here the mainly the herbs are used into the crude or into the extract form now nowadays all the world is shifted towards the herbal why because it is gaining the popularity nowadays most of the women are preferring natural products over the chemicals for their personal care to enhance their beauty this is the market scenario of herbal products that uh, the if we are projected to grow the market that is a 6.5% forecast period in between the 2018 to 2023 and it is also expected that it will be enriched usd 120 billion in the 2024 this is the evaluation of herbal cosmetic into the india and these are the products which are the brand which is preparing the cosmetics into the herbal form like himalaya vlcc lotus etc this is the modernization of indian traditional medicine so uh, nowadays in the large a section if you can say the rural or remote places the herbal medicines are mainly consider a major healthcare provider around the globes now the traditional system of medicine or the allopathy system of medicine there are some of the healthy lifestyles which is required for the uh, disease or for the preparation of medicinal uh, view you can say this is the classification of herbal medicine uh, into the international market or into the indian market so we are going to see this classification uh, into the detail view later on what are the advantages of herbal cosmetics so mainly uh, we need to see that there is not any type of allergic reaction should be there there is no side effects easily incorporated into the skin or you can say into the hair or any of the cosmetic Uh, to the uh, part of the body there are some of the disadvantages also mainly if you are going to compare it uh, compare it with the allopathic doses form then herbal required the long term therapy they are not the sudden action is like the allopathy it requires long term therapy while we are going to use the herbal products when it is initiated so there are numbers of monographs nowadays available into the indian pharmacopoeia or you can say usp pharmacopoeias they have included the herb and herbal products in their monographs nowadays there is one tkdl library also which is the traditional knowledge digital library which gives us information about the plants what are the plants what is its medicinal use what are the common names where it is grown so they have given the all the information related to the plants now this is the category of herbal cosmetics mainly the cosmetics are mainly divided into the five different types for the skin care for the hair for the nails in the form of powder shampoos and the miscellaneous products now the main classification of herbal cosmetics are into the two form the first on the basis of doses form and another is the the part of the body where it is mainly applied for so these are the two main class of the herbal cosmetics Now the first on the basis of the doses form, so we all know there are different doses form like what is emulsion, powders, cakes, oils, mucilage, jelly, suspension, etc. There are numbers of doses forms in which the herbal cosmetics are available into the market. There are the another classification on the basis of the parts or organ of the body where it is applied for, like the herbal cosmetics applied for the skin, herbal cosmetics applied for the hairs like shampoo, toning, dressing. Uh, bird softener shaving creams uh, the herbal cosmetics which is applied on the nails like nail polish and manicure preparation herbal cosmetics applied on the teeth and mouth like tooth powder mouth washes and dentifrices
the first we are going to uh, learn about the herbal cosmetics which is used for the skin in which there are some of the herbal fair, fairness cream vanishing cream moisturizer sunscreen these are the doses for which we are using for the skin preparation as in cosmetics now first for the skin so here we need to learn the three main principle here you can say three main objective for the skin the first one is the cleansing nourishing and the moisturizer if these three steps are there in any of the cosmetic then we can use it for the skin preparation there are some of the plants which is used for the dry skin or you can say sensitive skin as an example trifla tulsi then jethi murti some oil Uh, then coconut oil also banana papaya pulp if it is an oily skin then we can also use the terminilia arjunia tulsi uh, then the nimbu mustard oil milk uh, there are some of the fruits and its mask are also available uh, for the various different types of skins now uh, this is the list of plant in which the name of the plant is given its botanical name family the constituent and what are the uses in related to the skin care like aam chandan cucumber peel there are some of the others like neem tulsi lavender haldi it means that these are the common plants which are mainly used for the cosmetic into the skin care for the different different criteria so here the uses is also given so you can refer and use that plants for the preparation of skin if we are going to see about the dry skin treatment for the anti aging skin sun protection skin then there are some of the plants like castor oil coca butter coconut oil ginseng aloe vera oats so these are the plants which is used for the skin here there are some of the creams the types so it is available into the market like cold cream this is the formula of cold cream and it means that it is an emulsion which used to give the cooling effect to the skin when it is applied on the skin this is the vanishing cream so it is act as an foundation cream that disappears when it is rubbed to the skin these are some of the constituent which is used for the preparation of this vanishing cream now this is the cleansing cream which helps to cleans our skin uh, from any of the dirt or you can say uh, the oil so it helps to cleans our skin and these are the plants or these are the formula which is used for the preparation of uh, this skin and these are the marketed product which is available into the market in the form of cream or in the form of skin care product like elo velida vlcc ayur nivea there are so many brands are available in the form of herbal skin care cosmetic now there is a sunscreen also we all know that herbal sunscreen it means that they protect our skin from the uv radiation in which reduce the sun burns and other skin related damages and problems limbs spf is the main factor which is the sun protection factor which is helps to protect our skin from the uv radiation and that is the main thing when we are buying our sunscreen and this is the main factor we are observing uh, what are the uh, spf in that specific sunscreen now these are the herbal commonly plants which is used in the preparation of herbal sunscreen like aloe vera turmeric neem sandal wood camphor saffron the letting name is also in given and the main uh, chemical constituent which is used in that plant now this is the marketed sunscreen product into the different brands and here the spf value is also given like lotus having the spf 50 this is the 60 40 booty has an 40 uh, so there are the different different products with the spf herbal moisturizer is also available it means that it may be an oil phase it may be an water phase so see that the two phases with that the emulsion will be prepared and these are the constituent which is used for the preparation of herbal moisturizer now this is the marketed herbal moisturizer it is in the form of khadi it also contains the sandal wood orange peel kesar with help of that plants they are preparing the herbal moisturizer in which is available into the market right now as an commercialized product now the herbal deodorant or you can say herbal antiperspirant uh, there are roll ons are available into the market which is used as an deodorant which is used the substance which is applied on the body to prevent the bad odor or body odor which is caused by the bacteria now the second the herbal cosmetics which is used for the hair so there are number of uh, herbal shampoos are the uh, picture is given and there are the, the plants which is commonly used in each and every herbal uh, hair preparation 
So first we are seeing the herbal shampoo. Herbal shampoo it means that these are the cosmetics preparation which is helps to cleanse the hair and scalp. Uh, what are the functions of lubrication, conditional growth and these are the pictures of some of the uh, good branded shampoos available into the market. What are the advantages of the herbal shampoo? So it is in the pure and organic ingredient free from the side effects, no surfactant, no synthetic additives uh, likewise. Uh, so these are the advantages of herbal shampoo. Herbal hair conditioner, mainly the main uh, criteria or objective of the herbal conditioner, it means that it gives the luster, uh, it gives the shining and uh, it is also helps and needed for the dry hair. So it treated uh, the brittle hair. Okay, Hair darkener, it means that these are the preparation which used to color the hair. And there are so many synthetic preparations are also available in the market. But there are numbers of herbal preparation are also um, helpful to darken the hairs. Grey hair example, henna, amla, arita. And these are the uh, marketed preparation available into the market for the herbal cosmetic specifically for the hair. Uh, again, there are numbers of colored product or you can say the hair coloring material like henna, natural, uh, numbers of brands are available right now into the market which helps to color our hair and helps to protect from the gray hair. Now the third one that is the herbal cosmetic which is used for the teeth and mouth. Now the first one is the herbal that is the dentrifices. It means that these are the preparation which is used with the toothbrush and which used to cleanse the surface of the teeth. Uh, so uh, it is known as dentrifices which mainly used to help uh, the teeth from the decaying. These are the plants, the mainly neem, loving you can say that is the long dalcini, that is the cinnamon, pudina. These are the plants which is used in the preparation of dentrifices which is available into the market also. These are some of the herbal marketed preparation which is used for the teeth and mouth. There are toothpaste are also available into the herbal form right now. There are the mouthwashes are also available which is prevent from the bad odor of the mouth. Herbal cosmetics which is used for the nails uh, that are mainly used uh, to give the good nourishment to the nails and which is also helps to protect from some of the infection like bacterial or fungal infection to the nails. Uh, so the mainly the nail care it is mainly uh, very much difficult to cure because this is the body's hardest and so, uh, strongest tissue mainly it is give some of the nourishment to the nails and it is also protect from some of the infection like fungal and bacterial infection nail polishes are available which is mainly cover the animal and gives the color uh, cosmetic uh, effect to our nails and it is also helps the nails to resist uh, from the chipping and abrasion there are some of the herbal uh, for the eye care like eyeshadows are available, kajals are available. So it mainly gives the background color to our eye. Various shades are also available. Various color shadows are available like blue, green, brown and numbers of eyeshadows right now uh, available. Now there are some of the guidelines if we want to use the herbs as in herbal cosmetics. So first we need to take and care that there is no such allergic reaction should be there. There are no some of the side effects like nauseating, vomiting, headache should be done while we are using these herbal products. Now whatever the finished drug product you are preparing that must be evaluated with the shelf life, color, toxicity studies, biological assays and there are the skin irritation assay that must be evaluated with the herbal finished drug product or doses form. This is the list of plants which are the active ingredient which is mainly used in each and every uh, most of the type of cosmetics item and they are having some of the medicinal properties also. So they are used in a treating and curing some types of diseases which is related to the cosmetics. So these are the names of plants, the activities is given, it let is name and constituent is given and in which uh, you can say company they are mainly uh, using these plants in their uh, cosmetic items. Now there are some of the guidelines also for the using of this herbal cosmetics and this guidelines is the private body which is known as Cosmos. Uh, so we are going to review this guideline once. So Cosmos, it is in cosmetic, organic and natural standard. They have set a certification requirement while preparing and using the organic and natural cosmetic products specifically into the Europe uh, countries. 
so this is the standard recognized global uh, globally now in 20, uh, 2002 the cosmos has uh, composed with the five main countries and these five main countries has set some of the standards for the using and preparation of herbal cosmetics now what are the main rules for this guideline so it helps to promote the use of product from the organic culture they are mainly checking that whatever the cosmetics is preparing that is 100% natural resources or not what are the uh, natural and processing manufacturing guidelines you are going to follow so that everything is uh, to be checked and after that the documents is need to be published with this standard so uh, the cosmos label must be there there are some of the guidelines some of the additional information that we need to follow while preparation of this now this standard if you are going to follow this standard then uh, what are the main uh, advantages so the composition of this total product storage manufacturing that everything is to be defined and it is regulated by some of the body so it must be a marketed regulated so this is all about the herbal cosmeceuticals i hope you all understand and thank you very much for the listening thank you